What is going on guys? It's Scott with Never Hedge back for another Illuvium update. We're just going to do a quick one today. I just put out a more extensive video on Illuvium uh, last night, but a couple of things have been updated uh, since I put that video out. So I figured I would make another quick update for you guys. Quick look at the price chart right now. We're down 5.9%. Uh, from when uh, we made that video on Saturday. So we're down actually probably even more since the video. I think the price was right around 778. Now we are at uh, 758. So uh, like I said in that video a couple of days ago that I was gonna hold off on buying for a couple of days to see where the bottom might be. Uh, that decision is proving to be more and more correct as who knows how long this downtrend will continue for. If it goes uh, much lower than like 740, 730-ish, I'll probably throw a couple of bucks in there uh, just for fun, but probably not a lot. So what do we want to get to today? We have some updates on their Discord scam. So this is straight from Kieran himself came out after the uh, video was uploaded. As most of you are aware, the Discord was compromised on the 31st of December and 150,000 in funds were stolen from approximately 41 wallets. They cannot be sure about that number as uh, they believe some of those wallets may be the scammer. They did, however, resolve the situation in less than three minutes, which meant they could minimize the damage significantly. However, this does not absolve them of the vital role of keeping the community safe. For that reason, they've, imp they've implemented an opt-in system that requires all members to verify that they have read the rules and risks of joining the Discord. They also have pruned over 50,000 members, which helps clean up a lot of the bots. Uh, long story short, guys, if you receive a DM from anyone other than uh, one of the core contributors here please assume it is a scam and we do have a couple of updates on the hack as well from the SILV token that we covered in the previous video here is a quick update so uh, 8,000 SILV was stolen they removed approximately 335 ETH from the liquidity pool that is why we go over here we can see it is down almost 100 percent from 532 now down to 68 cents so do not buy silv all right back to the hack update they have engaged a third party to help them with the chain analysis as the council has met and decided that they need more information before voting on a proposal they are hopeful that they will have the relevant data for the council by tuesday so tomorrow this means they should have a decision by the end of the week uh, this is very frustrating but they got to trust their democratic process. This only relates to transactions post block 139-40833. Anything prior will be reimbursed after they complete the analysis. So where does this put the land sale and the Illuvid decks? So unfortunately, there will be delays regarding the V2 contracts, which means uh, a hold on the land sale and the Illuvid decks. They will have new timelines for us as soon as possible. They're exploring several options to make the sale accessible to everyone in the community. Uh, a couple more things that I want to get to on this and then we'll wrap it up. So we got some more character leaks here from the designer. Just some simple uh, motion graphics stuff. Pretty solid. Beetle attack. Boom. Nice little rhino beetle. And then they have some Unreal Engine 4 uh, renderings of the maps. So obviously uh, very sick, more stuff from the Unreal Engine. But uh, that is all I got for you today. Just a quick update on where we were at with the hacks and the uh, stolen ILV and all that. So as always guys, please make sure you are subscribed to the channel for more updates on Illuvium as well as other NFTs, stocks and tokens we like. And I thank you guys so much for watching this far and I will see you all in the next video.